Did you see the, the, the indicator go down? Yeah, I did. Yeah, it's that that quick. I got it hooked on a rock, I think. To understand why I'm standing in a freezing Colorado River and hooking rocks, okay. you have to go back several months yep, to the time I took Lester to the gym Point and style. introduced him to my passion, gymnastics. You go like this, you go. <laughs> <laughs> I think this whole thing was just to make fun of me. Well, payback begins on Colorado's South Boulder Creek, northwest of Denver, where I introduce Amy to one of my passions, fly fishing. I'm telling you, you're going to love this. I'm excited. You certainly are loaded up already. This, well, this takes a lot more skill than gymnastics. It also takes an experienced guide. Matthew Burkett. Matthew, hi. Hi, Amy. Nice Welcome. to meet you. Welcome. We, I'm in heaven here. I brought a lot of my own stuff. Good. I hope you brought some stuff for me. Thankfully, Matt had everything I'd need. If nothing else, I was going to look the part of an angler, although I didn't have one of those. This is a waiting staff. It's like a, a, it's a stick that I pull out. So you're going to look like Moses in the water? Fly fishing is all about artfully casting. Okay. One See, more time. I, I, lift it, lift it, lift it. Uh, okay, it's just casting fine. something into the water that mimics the insects trout like to feast on. We just keep looking for a bug until we find one they're willing to eat. In this case, bugs at their nymphal or early stage before they grow into flying insects. Cast right down the line of my arm. There you go, that's perfect. Surprisingly, I quickly went from hooking rocks to oh. hooking fish. You yep, you got one. Good. Take your finger off the yeah. line. When he's running, you want to take your take your hand off the reel. Yep, let it spin. Good. Keep going, 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 keep going. Good. Now stop for a minute and just pull. Oh yeah. Very nice. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> that didn't even take long. Look wow. It. Well done. Not well, bad, not bad. Guy, right? He's small. He is. You know what? You he's actually cute. had a different. Tell me she didn't just say cute. Every fly fisherman's dream to hook a cute fish. I'll stick with the big ones, thanks. There you go. First cast. Oh, and it's a big Oh, fish. that's a Look beauty. That that's a beauty. Wow. Well done, Lester. Very well done. There we go. That's right. Look at that fish. Look at that. Wow. Wow. Great fish. Oh, what a beauty. Great what a beauty. fish. Oh. Very well done. Good Thank job, you. Let's Lester. Get him, let's get him back in the water here where he belongs. There you go, buddy. All right. Though Lester was clearly the more experienced angler, he soon had some more formidable competition. All right, some girls in the water. I'm excited hey. to see this. I'm Hi, Amy. nice to meet you. I'm Ann. Hi, Hi. Gina. Good, good to meet you. Ann Sheehan and Gina Salazar could teach us both a thing or two about fly fishing. There he is. Oh, yeah. A little one. And about living. Both are breast cancer survivors who were introduced to the sport as a form of therapy through a program called Casting for Recovery. The casting, it's actually good therapy for the arm. I actually had, had lymph nodes removed on my right arm and my motion was impaired. Both attended fishing retreats with other cancer survivors where they also found emotional healing. When I tried it, it wasn't as hard as I thought and I really enjoyed it. For me, it was very relaxing to just get out and cast and completely focus on the moment. Meeting Gina and Ann on the river was inspiring. It gives me hope and hey, and and that hope for that next great big fish. And, and besides, it's fun. And it also reminded me of another fact of fly fishing. It's not a real strength sport. It takes patience. And, yep. and it also takes listening. And women always seem to outfish the men. There you go. Good job. Good job. Next time, I'll make her cast off a balance beam. I got another one. I didn't realize I screamed every time yeah. I got a fish. Yes, yeah, well, that didn't I'm happen sorry. very often. You didn't get a lot of fish. All right. <laughs> But, but can, we, can we show the pictures? You got two. Yeah, but, and in fact, you but, can see some more. Look at my that was face. Your largest That's a beautiful fish. shot. Now let's yeah. look at my largest fish. Yeah, okay. Thank so you. Yours was Moving much on. Bigger Still and to better and prettier. <laughs> and by the way, if you want to see some more snapshots of our trip out west, you can log on to the website todayshow.com. And you will also find. Did you want to say something? No, no, good. Okay. Good, good. A link to the nonprofit organization Casting for Recovery, which of course hosts fly fishing retreats for women with breast cancer, like the two you saw with us. Great folks we met they out were. there. We had a good time. You were a good sport. I know. Thank it was a little, little cold. I couldn't feel my feet from my knees down. And the fish out. were a little slimy.